Hi everyone. I'm going to be going over question number 9.13 from the bingo problem. Uh, this question, I'll read it first. It says a turntable rotates with a constant 2.25 radians per second squared angular acceleration. After four seconds, it is rotated through an angle of 30 radians. What was the angular velocity of the wheel at the beginning of the four second interval? Um, so, and then I just rewrote kind of the main part of the question here. And then the, these values are what we know. So we know that the acceleration is 2.25 radians per second squared. Uh, the time is four seconds and the uh, angle or theta is 30 radians. So I'm going to erase the question just to give more room to work. Um, but for this, we're going to need to uh, use one of our equations. The one we're going to want to use is uh, theta equals uh, the initial angular velocity times time plus one half alpha time squared. Um, and from this, we know that we want to solve for this initial angular velocity, right? It wants to know what that velocity is uh, at the beginning of the four seconds. Uh, so it's going to be our, um, I always forget what symbol that is. I always want to call it W, but I know it's not. Um, but anyway, looking for the initial. So to do that, we need to obviously isolate that and so we're going to end up with um, that equaling, subtract this over, so it's going to be theta minus one half alpha t squared over t. Um, and now that we've done that, really we, we have all the information we need. So let's just plug in the numbers we need. So we know that theta is 30 radians, so it's going to be 30 minus 1 half. Our alpha is 2.25 radians per second squared. Um, our time is 4 seconds. And that's squared over the four seconds. Uh, so now when we solve this, uh, we'll plug that into the calculator and we'll end up with um, and we end up with exactly three radians per second. So, so that initial um, angular velocity uh, with that constant acceleration uh, ends up being three radians per second. So, Hope you learned something. Hope you enjoyed watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.